Welcome to Day of the Diver. As I was just telling my chat here, this is a game that's been described to me as a mixture of Subnautica, Cook, Serve, Delicious, and Moonlighter, and a game that is able to successfully merge those three games. Definitely seems like something I need to play. I also need to turn this down just a smidge here. Eh, about right there seems good. Let's give it a go. Fantastic pixel art. Those are just blended roots. Delicious. I'll let this play out. This is nice. I'll let him finish his roots. Finish my coffee while he's at it. Cheers, Dave. landing. I haven't actually checked. I think this might be this team's first game. They've been met with overwhelmingly positive reviews on Steam for uh, the early access version of Dave the Diver. No, oh, Dave, you got here quickly. Well, I was told to hurry here. I was on vacation, you know. Where's the sushi at? <laughs> now don't rush yourself, have a look around! Okay. Look at this giant blue hole, I've never seen anything like this. It's not just the size. Every time you enter the giant blue hole, the terrain and ecology changes. Which means, <laughs> this could be an incredible business opportunity! <laughs> what kind of business? Well, we can discuss that later. I heard you took a break from diving. How about warming up? I'll guide you from here, go ahead and go on in. <laughs> I don't have a good feeling about this. A sushi bar by the blue hole. I can move. I'm real good at moving. I already absolutely love the animations. Ooh. Nice form! Ha <laughs> ha! All right, how about try stretching out a bit? Try moving to the marked area. With shift, you can move quickly. Remember, this speeds up oxygen consumption. Cool. Oh, that looks really nice. I gotta go over here so it stops dinging at me. Good, looks like your skills are intact. Your moves are as nimble as a freshwater snail. I don't know if that's a compliment. Let's now practice using the weapon you'll need in contingencies, the dagger. Try using the dagger on small fish. I don't want to. All right. What, am I just supposed to stab the fish? Well done, smooth and quick. And finally, you haven't forgotten how to use the harpoon, have you? The harpoon, well, I haven't used one in a long time. You aim first and then... It looks like you'll need some practice. Let's try using the harpoon to catch, let's say, three fish. Ooh. Whoa! Holy 
Holy shit! Okay, hold on. I got it. I got it. Hiya! Yeah! Man, that is violent. Oh, it's got a little distance. Okay. Or a limited distance, I mean. Got him. I think that should get you back on track in no time. Come on back up to the boat. My face covers the achievements. Oh, my bad. Okay. Yeah, I figured I'd have to find a better spot. Dave, you love sushi, right? For sure. That soft fish meat with oily rice. Oh, man, that's just the best. Well, listen up. I have a friend who's a sushi chef who left the business for a while. He has a bit of a sharp tongue and a slight temper, but he's got one skill I think is guaranteed unmatched in the world. It is right here that I started a restaurant with my friend that sells one-of-a-kind sushi. The sushi sold here is made from fresh fish caught in the blue hole where fish from all over the world can be found. Don't you think people will just go nuts for it? I'm already craving it. I bet. So, why don't you join in on this awesome venture as well? What do you say? I love eating, but I don't know a thing about cooking. Nothing to worry about. Restaurants all ready. All you need to do is dive to get the ingredients. Doesn't sound too bad, right? Yeah. So I can eat as much sushi as I want? Yeah. Sure, you have to pay, though. Can't wait to check it out. The sushi restaurant next to the Blue Hole. It was supposed to open tonight, but I'm not sure if it's ready. Let's go have a chat at the restaurant. Ah, ha, ha. All right. Sushi. This is fantastic art. Very good looking game. Hey, Boncho! We all ready to open? As you can see, it's ready just in time. Mm. Oh, it's already finished? Mm. You? Ah, you're the fisherman Cobra was talking about. Mm. Well, I'm more of a diver than a fisherman. Mm. Alright. Anyway, it's nice to meet you. I'm Boncho. Mm. You like sushi? Mm. I sure do. Tuna belly, eel, sea urchin. Mm. Oh, just thinking about it makes my mouth water. Mm. Just as mediocre as expected. Mm. Sushi is a food that combines the soul of sea and land. It symbolizes Mother Nature herself. Most people, however, have only tasted more accessible fish just like you. How empty a life is one that ends without ever tasting the beauty Mother Nature can offer. My calling is to bring the taste of Mother Nature to everyone- Uh-oh. Uh, an earthquake? Mm, the interior is really quite a mess. Yeah, it looks like we'll have to delay the opening today. You know what? I spent all my money getting this restaurant ready. I'll have to recover the repair costs through doing business. In this state? <laughs> In the end, the importance of a restaurant is the taste. First, we need ingredients. Did you bring anything? Well, I have something I just caught. Only three fish. This won't be nearly enough to serve the guests. Please go and catch seven more fish first. Oh, and the restaurant's only going to be open in the evening. Won't that decrease sales? You think we should invite customers without adequate preparation just to make a little more money? It's a chef's duty to prepare the best possible food with meticulous precision, just as a warrior sharpens his sword on a whetstone. You'll need to get me the best quality ingredients during the day. Okay. Off I go, I guess. It seems Boncho's really passionate about his work. He may not talk about personal stuff, but this guy can talk about sushi all night. Blah ha ha. I haven't seen Boncho so enthusiastic since the incident. It's nice to see him like this. The incident? Uh, maybe I shouldn't have brought it up. Well, anyway, we need more ingredients, so go catch seven fish first. Can do. Make a hundred gold? Catch seven fish. I think I can handle that. Beautiful game. 
Uh, all right, so we got a we got a timer effectively with the O2. Oh, this is wonderful. So I'm guessing we can't go too deep yet. Yeah, you can see. Doesn't like that depth. Ooh, a chest. I'm guessing jellies aren't the most appealing meal, but maybe I should try it. Used as a food ingredient. And a rubber toy hammer. Oh, it hurts. I don't think sea urchins can be picked up with these gloves. Guess I gotta find a way to get those. Curious. That does not work, yeah. That's my thought. Got one. Oh, I gotta hit space to... Oh, jeez, it can get away. Okay, okay. Noted. Let's catch Dory. Nice. Knife him? Well, I've got a rubber mallet now. <laughs> got a squeaky rubber mallet now. That's pretty good. Oh, I feel bad. I just damaged it. There we go. Hey, that harpoon certainly seems effective. Nice. Can I get the seahorse? Apparently not. There's still plenty of O2. Looks like we've got, like, a utility item that we can have as well. We can swap weapons, too. Neat. Get it! Get it! Oh, yeah! Nice one. Careful, buddy. What's that? Blue seashell? Brown seashell? Alright, this depth. I guess we can go into it, but it's just... Oh, refill 50% of oxygen, nice. Oh, right, yeah. Oh, that's in the background too, okay. Ooh, big fish. Nah, what the heck? Get over here, you. You ain't getting away. Oh, you are getting away. Oh my god. Damn it. You! I'm gonna get you. Oh, you're an attacking fish. Oh! Oh! Go away! Leave me alone! Oh, shit! Get him! Get him! Yeah! That's what I'm talking about. Damn it. Alright, they can go. Ooh, more O2. Gimme, gimme. Hell yeah. Full refill. That squeak is so funny. A silver dish that I can sell at the Cobra shop. Gotta be on the lookout for this stuff. Escape pod. New content. Use the escape pod to escape to your boat as quickly as possible. Check your surroundings first as the calling process takes some time. Cool. Olive oil. Nice. Cool. Copper ore. Ooh, that seems useful. More O2. Thank you very much. Ooh, big guy. <laughs> He's trying to get me. I'm trying to get you. Your lunch. Well, all right. Ooh, a little goodie. Looks like this is the uh, right side edge. I'm not going to go any further than that, apparently. So I wonder how deep I can go. It's just a fancier version of Echo the Dolphin, yeah. Exactly. I'm holding off on... Uh... Oh, right, I forgot about sprint swimming, too. Yeah, that does... Consume the O2 quite a bit more quickly, but that is an option. Go away, lionfish. Big jerk. Get him. Get him. Come on. Come on! 
Yeah, nice one. You gotta mash that sucker. Oh shit! Ow! Oh, you shouldn't. <laughs> You can't make me mash the space bar and then make the prompt to skip by the screen you pop up afterwards, the space bar. That doesn't work. Alright, well, I feel like I can, yeah, I can put together what they're trying to tell me here. Too much weight. Gotta resurface. Alright. All right, looks like you caught quite a few. This rate will make boatloads of money in no time. Bwahaha. -ha. My, my, would you look at the time? We'll have to hurry up and get things ready. Why don't you head to the sushi bar? Okie dokie. Nice. I wish I could click those and see what they are. That'd be neat. All right. Wrap up your day and get things ready at Boncho. By the way, you'll only be able to dive once in the morning and once in the afternoon. Get the ingredients ready before the dinner hours start. Okie dokie. Boncho. I really love the art in this game. How are the preparations coming along, Boncho? I think we're mostly set. That's good. Here's to a great evening. Where do you think you're going? Didn't you hear from Cobra? You're to help me run the sushi bar from today onward. What? I don't understand. Cobra told me there would be somebody helping with the ingredients and serving. He said all I needed to do was cook. And who else is there for that but you? I've never worked at any restaurant before. The guests will be here soon. I'll give you a quick primer, so pay attention. What? Open the ingredients below. Press 4 to check ingredients. Here you can check your fish, crops, sauces, and all the other materials you've got. For now, that's all you need to know. Come back later for more information. Okay. Now I'll show you how to register actual items to the menu. New recipes need to be added to the menu before they can be sold to customers. There's a sushi recipe for the fish you acquired earlier, so try registering that to the menu. Can do. That probably wasn't that hard. Setting ingredients to auto supply will make things a bit more convenient. Only food on the menu can be sold. If you run out of ingredients, you'll have to replace items on the menu or refill the ingredients. You can also enhance the flavor of the dishes. So try it out when you have enough ingredients. Now use the ingredients you caught to fill out the menu as much as you can. Okie dokie. Add. Where's the autofill thing that he said? I guess I can't do that yet. Cool. There we go. How long are you gonna stand there talking? Give me a cup of green tea to quench my thirst. Have you perhaps poured green tea before? Ooh. No, only soft drinks, I think. Mm -hmm. I'll tell you how. Go over to Cobra. Pour Cobra green tea. Sometimes customers will order drinks. Ask to pour green tea to just the right amount. It's just like cook serve. Nice. Customers who drink green tea of a good or higher grade will pay more. As expected, Bancho's green tea is quite something. That tea really got my appetite going. Is there something to eat, perhaps? <laughs> Demanding, as always. Why don't you try serving them some food while you're at it? Okay. <laughs> you can dash when serving food. You shift to move quickly. Go, buddy! Hello? You sent the package last week, you say? What in the world? Let me check on that. Hmm. Cobra didn't even eat. He's always distracted like that. Hmm. The food can't be reused, so we'll have to throw it out. Seems like such a waste to throw it away. Boncho Sushi never reuses food. 
We do not put food made for guests on the table twice. <laughs> All right. Down cue to discard. Everything looks about ready. Mm, I haven't cooked for customers in a while. Kind of nervous. <laughs> Don't forget to press E after filling the menu for business to begin. Customers will order dishes from the menu. Don't forget to re register dishes from the menu before the sushi bar opens. Okay. Deal. Open! Woohoo! What's this? You won't be able to produce food if you run out of wasabi. Grind and refill the wasabi before it runs out. Uh, grind and refill. There we go. Cool. Okay. Hi there. Can I get you some green tea? Good. They're looking for it to be poured exactly to that line, I think. There you go. And then here you go. And then here you go. Oh, this is wonderful. All right. Let's go refill our wasabi real quick. It's a fun little animation for that, too. Thank you. There you go. I'm coming, I'm coming. Ooh, this is nice. So up here, I think we can see how many of each dish we have left to serve for the folks that are coming. Oh, I gotta... Oh, I gotta right click and then left click, I think, to clean that up. That's cool. All right. What is it? Oh, I think it's just together. Okay, I get it. Right click and left click together. Nice. Oh, all right then. Close for the day. I'm really enjoying the presentation of everything. Lots of extra little elements of flavor everywhere. Big fan. Made 43 bucks. Not quite what we needed. Work's finally done for the day. My back and legs hurt. I should. You were a bit clumsy, but not bad for a first day. Try a little harder next time. Work it all. I suppose coming from you, that's a compliment. <laughs> a man should not feel gratification from simple compliments! Mm -hmm. Yeah, alright. In any case, a toast to the opening of Bancho Sushi. I'm not done lecturing yet, I guess. <laughs> oh, that's good. Okay. I got a lot more interesting. Yoink. Day two. Raining. He the man who's been diving around here? <laughs> Yeah, I think so. I was expecting a younger, hotter guy. I can hear you, you know. In any case, can you do something for me? Shouldn't you tell me who you are first? I'm Ellie. I study biology at the graduate school of the University of the Philippines. I've come out to investigate after reports of anomalies in the area. Satisfied? Okay, so what do you want? I'd like to study the ecology of this blue hole. Get me some agar and red starfish first. I don't think it's a good idea to ask for just one of each, so give me two. Your tone makes me want to refuse. I've got a reward, but if you don't want it, that's fine by me. Reward? Well, I wasn't refusing. I'm just saying you could ask more nicely. In any case, please hurry. Don't dally. Smartphone. You can use your phone to access various types of content, check your current missions, and more. 
Cool. Oh, that's a that's a delightful way to do the settings menu too. That's that's very clever. I like that a lot. <laughs> it's just a calculator. That's neat. Check the weather. I'm just literally just browsing a phone in a game. Got anything on your calendar, buddy? Nah, anything to do? He's a well-organized guy. You want to just get away from it all this summer? Monbo Air is here for you. Mini games? Ah, we got to collect mini games, I guess. I got to take a picture. I want to take a selfie. Hello. What's the point of calling when you're so close? It's a waste of phone fees. Talk to me in person. <laughs> oh, okay. That's a valid point. I think it's time to dive. See you later, buddy. I've been loving the diving. Been having a good time with Dave. So far, so good. Ooh. He's a lumber. Let me sneak in there. Oh, there we go. Ooh, careful, buddy. Oops. Oh, I just realized. So we lost those O2 uh, tanks from last time. Apparently, we don't take those with us. O2 seems to act as HP and also as effectively our timer for the run. Oops. Stab him! Stab him! Stab him! Ow! Ooh, yucky. Hey, there's our sleepy toy hammer back. Hang on, I wanted to see... Doesn't do much damage, but it'll sometimes put fish to sleep. Ah, oh, that's fun. So that's the appeal to that thing, I guess. A little deep here. I think we should probably. Uh, oh shit! That's a big boy. Yeah, he's a. Uh, he's angry too. As is this lionfish. Well, apparently, I need to get this thing. There's one of our red starfish for. Ellie was her name, right? Ooh, the long sharp samurai sword. Hell yeah. Ooh, pufferfish. Go away. Go away. Leave me alone. That'll be a, uh, that'll be a tasty treat, won't it? I'll have to wait, I guess. There we go. One of those. Get um. Nice. Oh my god, come on. Is that enough? These guys are resilient. I don't think that's doing anything to it either. I got a lot of HP. Oh my god. Come on. I want at least one of you. There we go. Starry Puffer. Cool. Oh god. Wow, I can one shot them now. Alright, low on L2. I have to get one of these and then probably hit back up. I gotta get some fish. I got a little bit of time left. Nice. I don't have to go up just yet. Ooh, I might be able to get that chest. I probably shouldn't sprint, though. Come on, buddy, you got it. I believe. Ooh. Why does he move quickly underwater? Ooh, a scooter! Cool. I was a little late for that. Neat though. Wow! Ah, oh, it's the Subnautica scooter. Ah, oh, man, that's so nice. I wonder if I get to keep this. 
I hope so. Kind of doubt it, though. You actually brought them back? I guess I expected too little of you. All right, this should do for now. I'll give you a reward as promised since you helped me do my research. The sudden ecological changes in this, in this region will need to be studied further, so I'll continue to need your services. Add my number. Nice. That's a lot of gold. Oh, Dave, you collected a hundred gold. Great job. This should be enough to repair what's broken. Then give me some time. These repairs need to be done right. I really hope the customers keep coming. Me too, buddy. Otherwise, I don't think we can play the game anymore. That'd be a bummer. Dave, did you get to loosen up yesterday? I saw a lot of nasty fish. It won't be easy to go any deeper. I did notice the fish in the blue hole have an odd violent streak. Perhaps something put the, puts them on edge. Speaking of which, why don't you also take a gun? <laughs> in addition to the harpoon. A gun? I have a friend who's knowledgeable about guns. I'll introduce you to him. Hi, oh, Cobra. It's been a while. Who's the goofy-looking guy with you? Sorry, that wasn't the nicest thing to say to a stranger. Why is everyone so mean to Dave? Interesting, I thought divers were athletic and muscular. You seem to defy my prior knowledge. <laughs> People who live in glass houses. Uh -huh. Can I just, just be nicer to each other, huh? Just try to be a little more courteous in the first introduction to folks. Very cruel. I'd like you to get straight to the point. Uh -huh. I've begun a very interesting business, ha ha ha. And now I'm in need of some weapons. Duff, I need your help. Season two of Stristella just ended anyway. I'll give you a listen. This <laughs> popping up is very funny. I actually discovered a fascinating giant blue hole. The terrain and ecology inside it changes every time you go in. Oddly, any equipment found inside breaks down when brought out. I'd like you to make us a weapon that can be used inside. That is rather interesting. You've piqued my interest as a weapon researcher, you could say. My hypothesis is that anything that's not made from materials found in the blue hole will continue to break down. This will be especially true of guns, which have precious parts. I mean, precision parts. So we'll have to get the mirrored materials from the sea ourselves. Dave, you'll have to prove yourself as a diver to this Master Duff. Just call himself Master Duff? I'm not sure why I should have to prove myself to you. Just tell me what you need. Since it appears you have no guns at all, let's start with something easy. I think I'll need one rope and one scrap iron. You heard him, right, Dave? Enter the blue hole and bring back rope and scrap iron. By the way, if you're running out of oxygen midway, you'll only be able to make it back with one item. Always keep that in mind. Noted. All right. Go get the loot. So I don't think I'm going to have my scooter anymore. I hope I do. I love the way the rain is hitting the surface there as well. It's so nice. Yeah, no more scooter anymore. Lose all your loot when you come up, I guess. Maybe we can change that later. <laughs> Some early wood. Sneak into here real quick. I really enjoy this part of the game specifically. It's very peaceful. I wonder how deep we can go now. I've been wondering that aloud a couple times. Try to push it a little bit. Ooh, long distance underwater scooter. 20 seconds of battery time. Okay, so we can't just use that infinitely. Oh, we're apparently at critical depth as well. All right, so we should be careful there, I guess. Apparently we found rope too, good. All right, so yeah, it's a very limited use there, I guess. This critical depth is probably not something we'll wanna hang out in too much longer. I should get a few fish. 
Yo! Not the greatest at the quick space bar yet. That might be what we need. Nice. There we go. Check those boxes. We get to go exploring a little bit. Please don't hit me. Please don't hit me. Thank you. I'll take that. This is just downright pleasant. I have a very good time with this. Found some miso. Fun. Looks like we can uh, hang out underwater for a while, too. If we play our cards right. I am curious if I'm actually going to be able to take out that, uh, that big boy. He looks a little scary. Get in, buddy! Nice. Oh, I think I just found my newest strategy for that. I really do want to try to get him, but... Probably best to avoid him. Whoa, hello. That's a big guy. He's got a weird fucking face. This makes me, what is that weird fish game that was on like the PlayStation? I know I've mentioned it before. It's got like a fish with a human head. It reminds me a lot of this. Was it Seaman? Yeah, that was Dreamcast, wasn't it? Yeah, you're right. That sounds right. That was a weird fucking game. Rank 5 Parrotfish. And that is me over encumbered. We sweating it out now. Still seems to be moving around just fine though. Oh, fuck! <laughs> Let's just go the other way. That's your space, buddy. That's all for you. Chilling and shooting the shit with a human faced fish, yeah. Certainly a fitting game for the Dreamcast. Let's grab these couple of things and then probably be on our way. Got a lot of room left in the inventory here. Well, zero room left in the inventory, but apparently they don't seem to mind too much. Let me have some extra. There we go. We get on the uh, audio balance, by the way. You guys can hear me okay over everything. To think you'd actually managed to bring it back. I expected you to quietly expire in the depths. You could say, yeah, you, you, in a manner of speaking, you could say you expected me to slowly and brutally perish. Seems I've underestimated you slightly very well. I'll show you how to make the basic underwater rifle with these materials. First of all, download Duff's Weapon Shop on your phone. It's well optimized. Only 42 megabytes, you could say. I don't think you understand what that expression means. Yay. Oh, look at his little setup, too. Oh, baby, here we fucking go. This game is fucking fantastic. <laughs> this game is terrific. Oh my god. With a neat explanation like that, even someone like you should have understood. Well, I guess. 
Oh, one more thing. I've taken some measures to allow you to open weapon chests underwater. Wow, weapon chests. You can't bring them out of the sea, but they can still come in handy, you could say. Oh, but I'll collect info about the weapons you pick up and create blueprints for you. Weapons made with a blueprint won't break down underwater, you could say. In any case, this master will be watching you. Goodbye, eternity. Star. Cool. Craft weapons at Duff's Weapon Shop. Acquiring a weapon a certain number of times will complete a blueprint making the weapon craftable. Cool. You know the classic salutation, goodbye eternity? That's how I always part ways with people. Sushi time! Let's do it. We'll check the menu first. All right, yeah, we can sell stuff too. Look at all the little art for these. That's so good. Soy sauce, olive oil. I'm not really sure what I should sell yet, so I'll probably hold off on that. Set up our menu for the day. Ooh, enhancing. Enhancing ingredients used for enhancement will disappear. Gives us 20 per. Interesting. Oh, hell yes. Enhance has been completed. Nice. We can enhance it again? No, apparently not. This one, though. Nice. Totally. Hell yeah. Okay. Even further. Let's go. Good stuff. Gotta put the level three one on there, right? Absolutely. And then, ba boom. Let's do the max. Number three, yep. And right here, let's go with the uh, level two. Sounds good. Cool. Let's do it, Boncho. Open. Keep our wasabi stocked. How you doing? Want some green tea? Or some sushi? Oh, you want some green tea? See if I can get this right. How's that? Pretty good! Almost at the line that time. Don't get too tired now, Dave. Take it easy, buddy. Gotta watch that wasabi. Thank you, sir. Let's get on this real quick. Nice. Gotta clean up. Okay, I understand that now. Thank you. This game is great. Big fan. I think she might have actually gotten here first. Sorry, lady. There you go. There's no items on the menu. What are you talking about? I guess we're going to just do a normal sushi order then. Okay, okay. We got to catch enough fish to be able to feed everybody. That's what I'm realizing now. Understood. We got most... Most of them satisfied, though. Got some really nice revenue there, too. All right. You earned Artisan's Flame. Got a 4.6. That seems pretty good. 
Upgrading the recipes used up a lot of the fish you had. Ah, yeah, that makes sense. It did tell me that, didn't it? Got it. Hello. Hello. Are you Dave by any chance? No. Yeah, what is it, sir? Wow, I'm always right about these things. <laughs> nice to meet you. I'm Dr. Bacon. I'm an archaeologist who studies the Sea People civilization. The Sea People civilization? I'll explain it to you. Aren't you lucky to have an expert like me tell you all about them? Uh, maybe I shouldn't have asked. The Sea People civilization live in legends. They're said to have occupied this region a very long time ago. They worshipped fish and had gills, allowing them to live underwater. They lived in the depths, allowing them to flourish without any concern for invasions by other civilizations. But sudden changes to the sea bottom brought about their abrupt downfall. That's about all there is. Everyone thinks it's a myth and nothing more, of course. The proof they were real was found right in the vicinity of this place. Huh? This is an amazing find, one that could turn the whole academic world upside down. An ancient civilization under the sea. You only see such things in comic books or games. What makes you so sure they were real? My assistant closely analyzed an artifact found nearby and found it's no from no known civilization. It dated to around 1500 years ago as well. There were no civilizations in these parts back then. That is interesting, but what business do you have with me? Well, you see, my assistant's cryptocurrency investments didn't pan out and he won't be around for a good while. Had to get that shot in there, huh? That's why I'd like you to help me. Oh. My assistant told me the artifact was found 70 meters or so below the surface. Please go take a look. We're busy with the sushi bar. I don't think we can... <laughs> Sorry to interrupt the conversation. I'm Cobra. I work with Dave. Of course we should help you. We'll gladly do so. Yeah. <laughs> what? We don't have time to swim around searching for artifacts. Think about it. If an underwater civilization is discovered, countless people will flock here. Bancho Sushi will be bursting at the seams. I suppose you have a point. <laughs> All right, I'll help. Isn't that lucky? Well, of course, I won't be asking you to work for free. I'll upgrade the diving suit you're wearing for free. Whoa! With an enhanced diving suit, you'll be able to venture deeper. This is essential for exploration. These days, even such things can be handled by an app. Technological advancements are amazing, huh? Let's first install the iDiver app on the phone before we proceed. Nice. I was hoping we could. Allows you to uh, enhance various diving equipment, upgrade equipment with the money you make at the sushi bar and elsewhere. Oh. Now then, let me tell you how to use iDiver. Oh, yeah, yeah. I'll install the app for you, so unlock your phone first. Boom. Boom. Diving suit. Upgrade. Nice. You now dive deeper. Oh, yeah. Good. Now you'll be able to venture a bit deeper. Oh. Once you have enough money, use iDiver to enhance your equipment. You can enhance your suit as well as your cargo box and oxygen tank. Oh, yeah. Never forget that anything can happen in deep waters. I'll be in touch. Mildly ominous. Chapter 1 begins. All right, here we go. All right. So, I think I need to craft this in order to have it this time, right? I'm pretty sure. Now oh, we get to watch this again. Yay. Oh, a new one. They made multiple versions of this. That's outstanding. Oh, that makes me so happy. I love that guy now. He's becoming a new favorite. Let's see. I want to upgrade my cargo box. So I can bring more fish. And then I'll upgrade my air tank. Cool. Let's dive. See if I can find a Sea People artifact. I'm late to the party. This is a game where you play as a guy playing a game on his phone. Correct. Well, it will be once we unlock the mini games to play on his phone. But that's the that's the goal. <laughs> I'm enjoying it a lot too. Yeah. 
I think the layout might be the same. I hope not. I, I would prefer it be randomized. Already a fan of our upgrades here. I suppose I should try to uh, prioritize as many fish as I can. So we can make money at Boncho. Yay, got a scooter again. Let's see if the gun is enough to take out this guy. Uh oh. Uh, he's a chomper. Scoot away. There he goes. Ooh, nice. Titan trigger fish. Hell yeah. All right, the gun's doing work. Ooh, more ammo. All right. Ooh, that looks like a gun box, too. Wow, triple axle. Its shots are powerful, but cannot pierce. Picking up new weapons will allow you to collect blueprints. When you reach a certain number of blueprints, you'll be able to craft the new weapon. Triple axle, huh? These, this wild horse can finish enemies with just three bullets at close range. Nice. The rope there, too. I'm gonna go ahead and get a few of these guys, I think. If I can hit them. There we go. Ah, damn. Yeah, I do think the layout is the same, actually. Looks very similar to the way it was before. There's an escape pod, okay. Probably go ahead and use our gun now. Nice. It's pretty effective. I feel like the trigger fish is gonna be a nice haul, too. Fragment for weapons nearly filled up our inventory, actually, should. Sorry, big guy. I feel bad doing this to him. Oops. Oh, come on now. Oh, god damn it. Alright, hold on. Gotta play this smart. Damn it. Oh shit. Uh oh. Oh, wait, we can get this guy? Hold on, he can actually do that? So close. You running? You scared? You better be. I would be too. I'm pretty terrifying. Yeah, that's right. Get him. Ah, there we go. This one too. Get him. Get him. Completely overfill the inventory. I ain't giving up. I mean, honestly, I feel bad not killing this thing at this point. We've got to be bleeding out by now. Come on, buddy. Just let me end your suffering. Get it. Get it. Yeah. Nice. Okay, clearly we've got way too much shit now. Although I bet we could get even more. Yeah, the inventory seems to just be like a more of a suggestion than anything. Another underwater scooter. I think the big guy had two harvests. Oh, really? Oh, shit. I did just find this over here. Oh shit. Oh, okay, yeah, no, we're fine, we're fine. Curious. Uh-oh. That's not good. Yeah, I think it's time to go. I think it's time to bail. I think it's time to boogie. Oh, we have air! Can I get away from him? Help. Help. Oh, fuck, I'm on a scooter! No! Oh my god. He's running. Okay. Thank god, we've been saved. Saved from myself. Oh, I have a new scooter. How do I use it? There we go. Oh, that was close.
Yeah, overburden drains O2 faster, I think, is the whole, th the whole deal there. Oh my god, the whole day I haven't had my fancy light on. Can't see my pretty face. There we go. Silly bear. Oh, look at that! Brand new depth best. We got a lot of fish that time, I felt like. Hello. Dave, while you were out at sea, the repairs were completed. Hello. Let's head to the restaurant! Okay. Should have a good day at Boncho's today. Wow, it's looking really nice. It doesn't matter how delicious the food is, the restaurant can't be a mess. If you want to change the interior, the interior menu below is open, so please check it. Okay. You can now freely change up the interior of Boncho Sushi. Use the interior tab to select the style you're liking. Ah, but as Dr. Bacon said, if the remains of the sea people are found here, customers will indeed come, but this area is kind of remote. So I think I'll need a way to advertise the store till then. Yeah, these days it's just about impossible to attract customers without publicity. Have you tried the social media app named Cooksta? You mean the social media app young people use to post pictures of the food they eat? Yeah, that's all. Businesses are probably promoting themselves lately. I simply cannot understand why people would waste their time like that. Sushi makes an impression on the heart, not photographs. Even so, isn't it better to use it than to keep people ignorant of your food, Boncho? Mm. You have a point there? Mm. Making it account is simple, so let's try it. Mm. You first register and make the hashtag Boncho, Boncho Sushi. Then done. Mm. Well, it's not as complicated as I expected. Mm -hmm. Now customers happy with your food will follow Boncho Sushi. Mm. I'm not sure about this, but okay. Mm. I'll also install the Cooks the app on my phone and check the followers posts. Yeah, we're just doing a full-on immersion into my actual life, huh? You know, me being a professional sushi chef that lives out on the water. Raise your rating at Cooksta. More customers will visit and new foods will be unlocked. The unlock conditions of new ratings can be seen in the Cooksta app. Cool. Ooh, we can get light wood. Oriental modern? Yeah, I'll go for that. Nice. What else can we do? New chairs, ceiling, lighting, decor, fun. Cobra's picture, absolutely. Oh, look how cute all of us together in Boncho's. So sweet. Time for today's menu. Let's see, let's do no enhancements today serve as much of the good stuff as we can. See how that goes. Although, wait. Oh, does the level up for it persist? It does, doesn't it? Okay, that's pretty cool. Yes. Hell yeah, Boncho. Level three green humphead parrotfish, parrotfish sushi. Now, we only have one of those now. But... That'll be a good one. The rainbow needs three of them to enhance. This one needs six. Okay, so yeah, we don't want to do any more, I don't think. There we go. Oops. Cool. All right, good stuff. Managed. What does that mean? Oh, right. It's just we're selecting it. Okay. Cool. Let's do it, Boncho. You ready, man? What's happening? Food with a high taste score will increase customer satisfaction. Never stop learning. What are we waiting on here? Menu's full, right? Pet the cat. Gotta pet the cat. Mew, mew, mew. Did I forget something? Oh, it's not nighttime, right? Yeah, we gotta go back out to the boat. It's diving time. But we could just set the menu there, I guess. Okay, let's go dive again. Hooray! 
Sandusky Grouper. Hey, it's Echo. It's all right, I speak dolphin. Oh, dolphin. It seems to be asking me to follow. There, I'll be gay. I mean, obviously we're gonna follow the dolphin. Look how good the dolphin looks. Oh, what a sweetheart. Let's go play with our dolphin, pal. Wait, buddy, I can't keep up. You're so fast. Dolphin pal, hold on. Oh, I'm coming. Oh no! Oh, your friend is stuck. I should cut that net. I will. I will cut that net. I can help you guys. Yeah. Yay. Friends. Happy dolphin. Drop something shiny. Seems to have left a gift. I didn't even know dolphins had mates. What do you got? A pearl! Hey, that seems good. Alright. Probably worth a lot of money. Okay. We're gonna make priority number one for this particular dive to find that sea artifact. Also, I want to catch this fish. Come here, you. Oh, fuck. Oh, shit. What's that purple symbol above that thing, I wonder? Maybe that means I am in, like, detection range. Which means I should leave. Right, I have a gun. I gotta remember that. Some iron. Hello. Get the hell out of here. Poison harpoon. Cool. All right, time to go down. Down into the depths. It's a little scary, man. This is some unknown territory. Squids, right? Yeah. What's this guy, I wonder? Hey, buddy. Just let it happen. Got some glass, cool. Oh, shit, a current. Oh, very strong one. This dude is resilient. There we go. Rank seven. Ah, there's the dusky grouper we were reading about. We have maxed out my inventory. All right, I gotta be looking for my uh, target now. Oh, nice, a scooter. Let's go ahead and use this. Get my O2 back. That is a strong current, my god. necessarily want to go down there. I think the thing was at, what did it say? 70 meters. So we need to go a little further down. About this depth here. Is that it? That might be it. Yay! Oh, Dave, I think that's the one! Come back to the boat safely. I'll be waiting. Big. 
What was that just now? I'll have to go back to the boat right away. Yep. Lots of sushi with that one, ah, huh? yeah. Be eating for days. Yeah, I was gonna say, we have an escape pod somewhere nearby, didn't we? These fish are tough down here, dude. Took 30 freaking damage. There we go. Alright. I still got a lot of O2. But I'm pretty deep. I should probably try to get back up. Make sure you don't get caught in this. I think the escape pod was just past us. Or just past this wall over here. There we go. I got a little more O2. I can wander around out here. Should be easy to get back to. Set a new death record. Oh, fuck. Yep, never mind. Not going that way anymore. I see this thing, though. Hold on. We got more ammo, too. Nice. Thank you. There's another fragment. This is a little spooky wandering around over here, but I think I'll be okay. Ooh, we got the sharp Japanese sword. Nice. I'm gonna try that out on this guy. Oh, never mind. Maybe you? No? Aya! Ay! Yo! <laughs> so good. Makes me very happy. Let's go get these things first. And then we'll go get the O2. Nice. Oh, he is filled up. All right, so we can get no more. Looks like it's about 150% capacity before he's like, that's it. No can do. Can't even get the O2 when he's like this. Oh, shit. That's good to know. Really doesn't feel like he goes that much faster at all when he's doing the sprint, huh? Oh, yeah, we might just be out of slots. I think you're right. Yeah, because 19.2 sounds like a weird place for it to cut off, doesn't it? We must just be out of inventory slots. Which we can upgrade, of course. Hopefully we'll be able to make some more cash tonight. Monchos. All right, looking good. Let's get out of here. All right, yeah, you gotta actually call it down. There we go. This guy's a little deep sea book. That's adorable. David's so wholesome. All right, you brought it out safely. It seems to be in very good condition. Almost as if it was stored somewhere until recently. Very interesting. This may be the find of the century, even. All right, Dave. Let's continue to work together and uncover the secrets of the Sea People civilization. What? I, I thought I'd only be helping you once. <laughs> of course, say no more. Just put our restaurant at the top of the list of affiliates. That won't be hard to do. I have a very lucky feeling about this. I'll be in touch. All right. I guess that's more reason to uh, sell some stuff, too, is to clear some inventory space, huh? Cool. It's already evening. I feel stiff. Even so, Boncho's working alone. I should probably help. 
It's not easy to manage with two people with more customers coming in. Need more staff. Alright then. Back to Bonchos. That doesn't look good. Never want to see a lady with a clipboard. Looks around. This is Bancho's sushi place, huh? Hmm. Miss Yoshi. I came by because I heard this place is getting popular on Cooksta. The name gave me pause, but to think it's really your place. New food using never before seen ingredients. Can't taste this anywhere else. A taciturn but masculine chef. Wow, did they mention me too? No, not really. In any case, what brings you all the way here, Miss Yoshi? No well, various reasons. Wanted to check out the restaurant. Looks like you're still the same. Well, there's nothing to change. I simply continue on day by day training myself. My goodness, that is the problem. You refused to listen to me last time in a similar fashion, and that's what got you booted from the hotel. You're talking about that again. That's the customer's fault for judging the food without even trying it. How long will you continue treating customers that way? Mm. Keep making that terrible food. What do you mean terrible? Whole roasted shark head is an excellent dish. Shark has been used in cuisine in both the West and in the East, and in Korea it was even used in ancestral rituals. Stop, you've not changed one bit. Let me judge for myself then whether it's food fit con for consumption. Then I can tell you why I came. Fine then, I'll show you. I'll make sure you know the true taste of shark head meat. Pancho, isn't this development a bit sudden? Dave, as a chef, this is a fight I can't back out of. My pride hangs in the balance. Please give me a white, please give me a white tip rep, white tip reef head shark, shark head. White tip reef shark head. I, I knew I could say it. And olive oil. You want me to catch a white tip reef shark? Yes. With your skills, it should be easy enough to do. But a harpoon's not likely enough. Take a good gun with you into battle. Even so, fighting a shark sounds way too dangerous. Do you mean to say you'll just stand by and watch while my pride is trampled? The white tip reef shark is usually found in the ocean far to the right. Far to the right. He suddenly wants me to get him a shark head. This is preposterous. I think I'll be killed with a gun? I'll have to ask Duff to make me a gun. Or search for one. Golden from Yoshi. Sometimes special customers with a backstory will hear of the sushi bar and visit. Learn dishes that the customers went, want through research and serve them to the customers. You can now research new recipes. Use the artisan's flame to expand your menu. Research the head of a white reef shark that's been deep fried whole. Hell yeah. Those animations are top tier, man. That makes me happy. All right, let's see. Still don't think we're selling anything. Can't enhance. Can't enhance. Ah, there's the auto supply. Okay, I see. I see. All right, I think it's time to uh, open the restaurant for the night. I'm not gonna be able to serve her her special thing, but I think we still go anyway. Let's do it. Yeah, I ain't got that. Green tea. That it? Nice. A little overfill, or a little overfilled, that's okay. I haven't quite gotten that exact hit to the line yet. I'm gonna get it one time. One of these days I'll do it. Run! Oh, there you go. Do, 
do. Got a tip. Yay. Crushing it. Oh, you know, hold on. I just realized I need to move my face slightly here, too, to, like, right there, don't I? That's better. Nice. That it? Perfect! Hey, finally. Knew I could get it. Can you change the menu during open times? Uh, maybe. Yeah, thank you for clipping that, Jen. Yeah, that was wild. Sweet. We got a cooks to review. Hell yeah. We got 400 gold. Goddamn. Nice. Five new likes. Titan Triggerfish Sushi at the top of the list. Five stars. All right. Good day. Yeah, the soundtrack's on point too, man. I've been really into this. Dave, I got the luckiest news! <laughs> What is it, Dr. Bacon? You look happy. I analyzed the artifact you brought me, and a large amount of an unknown substance was detected. I think it must be iron compressed deep underwater, but it gives off a unique wavelength. I went ahead and developed a radar to track those waves. Oh, and why is that news lucky? Being coy today, are we? This radar is bound to come in useful on your next expedition. What do you mean, my next expedition? Cobra forced me to go along last time. I was given a contract with your name on it. <laughs> the cancellation charge for breaking the contract is over 20... What in the world are you talking about? Ah, don't be so by the book. Check the signal for me to test out the radar. Give it to me. I'll tell you if it works. Poor Dave. What are you doing taking advantage of this poor guy, Cobra? Time to think of it, it's already been around eight years that we've known each other. I was having fun diving back then near Richelieu Rock. You suddenly wanted to get your suitcase that fell off the boat. I thought I was in real trouble back then. I was working as a weapon dealer and there were important blueprints in that suitcase. Luckily, you saved them before they could be ruined. I have no idea how I would have fought Hans Lindemann without the blueprints. Hans Lindemann? Oh, I was talking to myself, don't mind me. Oh, Boncho uploaded a new post. Let's check Cooksta. Pixel art sushi. Delightful. Just literally, like, scrolling what is effectively Instagram for exclusively food. On a fake phone. In a video game. Gotta get more followers. All right. You can like the post. That's adorable. Gotta like them all. Can you double click the image to like it? That would be pretty funny. Gotta make sure they all know that we appreciate the posts. Boncho with the perfect profile picture. Can we afford any... Upgrades here, we can. Let's upgrade to the steel harpoon gun. I feel like I'll be happy I did that. Awesome. This game rules, yeah, I agree. Time to get a shark. Chubbs is woofing. Chubbs, knock it off! Crazy over there. Radar. Radar. Radar, sonar, laser beams, jets, tanks, submarines. Gun enhancement kit. Cool. Upgraded the rifle. 
be cool if the fake Instagram and the fishing game itself had a fishing mini game. <laughs> Don't rule it out just yet. Ooh, a baseball bat. That's pretty great. Quick O2 refill. Thank you very much. I'm gonna try to be a little bit better about my inventory management this time. Big boy. See how the new gun does. Wow. All right then. Pretty effective. Another gun chest. Nice. Ooh, triple axle again. Actually worse than ours. You gonna get the shark head? Hopefully. I'm gonna head to the radar first. It did say the shark was all the way to the right, didn't it? It's probably still in that same spot it was before. Let's go over there first. I bet it's still just chilling on this edge. Oh, there he is. All right, let's do it. Charging? Yep, he sure is. Alright, here we go. Ooh! Whee! Get out of here. Yes! Angry shark. Do 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 do. Oh, we can do it more than once. got one bullet left in the gun. I have to keep that in mind. I got a decent amount of O2, though. Oh, speaking of which. There we go. Stone Cave. That's cool. Would you get out of my damn way? Let me get this gun chest. I think that sound is just the current. Ooh, small net gun. That's kind of cool. We found the net gun, specialized for capturing live fish. Critical depth here, apparently. I don't know if I can go to this radar spot yet. I think we might need to upgrade the uh, suit one more time first. Gonna see great. Yeah, I don't think we can go there yet. Oh well. Let's go back up to the top and use our net gun. I guess I could just... That was almost effective. Huh. Poor squid. Oh! Hello. I love that that works. Okay, I don't know if I'm supposed to actually try to get the, the squid. <laughs> Take that, though. All right, I'm out of slots again, so I guess I might as well just go ahead and go up. Yeah, I can't take it. All right. Can the net gun catch the jellyfish? Maybe. Might be worth a shot. That was a good day. Got the shark head after all. One out of three in the small net gun. And a new depth record. 
So we just gotta make enough money to uh, afford the suit enhancement to go deeper. Okay, already love this guy. Happy hop! You know a lot about this giant blue hole? Well, I'm not sure what to say to that. It's different in there every time. Yeah, that's it! It's the best place to collect Marinka! I could complete my collection in this place. <laughs> Marinka? What? Don't tell me you don't know the highly popular Ocean Life trading cards, Marinka! How can you not have heard of the futuristic trading cards that utilize an AI recognition system that automatically corresponds to fish in real life? I never heard of them. It sounds like fun, though. Oh, it's it's Ash if he was like 45. <laughs> That's pretty great. You seem quite behind the times. Let me help you install the app. So you do this, then press here, touch that, add a friend. Done. Okay, so what do I do now? The amazing thing about these Marinka is you don't really need to do anything special. Just catch a new fish and you'll get a card. Check the cards every now and then on the app and you're done. I see. I guess I'll be able to easily see what fish I've caught so far. That's right, it's almost like a... Well, you don't want to be saying the name, I understand. <laughs> I'll try it out. I almost forgot to introduce myself, didn't I? I'm Sato. Is it Sato or Sato? I'll give you my contact info, so hit me up if you have any questions. See you then! Choo choo! It does look like a Pokedex, doesn't it? Yeah, that's kind of funny. Catching fish will allow you to automatically acquire marine cards. You'll get fancier cards for catching higher grade fish. Cool. Alright. Guess it's time to dive again. Craft a rifle. <laughs> Yay! Here we go! Time to dive again. Oh, actually, I might have had the goal to upgrade the diving suit just then. We'll, my, we'll make this one mostly about uh, getting more fish. A gun chest right away. Ash Ketchum is called Satoshi in Japan. Ah, okay, okay. So we no longer have the steel rifle, do we? Was that just a one time upgrade for 300 gold? That doesn't seem right. That can't be right. Is this, this is the basic rifle, though, I think. Huh. Okay. Weird. It says level 2. That's just because I upgraded it, though. With the item that I just picked up. Oh, the squid again. Dude, that jump scared me. <laughs> I am on edge playing games like this for sure. Oh, no. Come on, bear. Come on, buddy. Get him. Get him. Yeah! I figured out how to do, this, how to do the space bar thing. <laughs> I'm already full in my inventory, Jesus. I gotta get an inventory upgrade. Pretty badly, clearly. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, they're, they're hostile down there, okay. 
Pepsi. Let's see what's going on with these. I got the shark head already, yeah. Uh, picked it up in the morning. You know, actually, I might be able to go deep enough here. Because it looks like this thing is like almost directly to our right now. Maybe if I go this way, I, I can reach it. I do have to get this thing, though. Get a little closer. Nice. Great Barracuda. Cool. If I just go underneath this, I bet it'll be fine. Critical depth, which I don't think is concerning outside of it just taking more O2. I think I'm fine. I would like to get up out of critical depth if I can. There we go. Hmm. It is pretty risky to go with this little O2. It's going pretty quickly. Yeah, let's not do that. That's not a good idea. We're just going to have to get the suit upgrade before we go that way, I guess. Comrade Barrick. 37 months. Give him some bear hugs, please. Welcome on back into the pile. Appreciate it. Enhanced harpoon tip. Nice. Bear hugs, thank you for the visa. Appreciate it. So yeah, you can clearly go well over 150%. Just drains the O2 much more quickly. And an escape pod, that's convenient. Might as well use our last two bullets here. Come here, buddy. Don't you run! No, 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 no! Okay. Alright, he's gone. Out of here. We'll just take these couple things and be gone. Uh, I straight up can't pick it up, right? No more slots either. Alright. Definitely well and truly filled up in the inventory. Needs to get a lot of loot though. Good day. Depth best, unsurprising. Great Barracuda. Wrap up the day and get things ready, a boncho. This game has got it all going on, man. It's so, it's so uh, full of heart. I love it. Okay. All about making that money. There is our whole roasted shark head. Got to put that on the menu for the day. Although she might not be here today, but I'm guessing she'll come back. White tip reef shark meat. To enhance that, you only need three. Yeah. Sounds good. Noise. Noise. Good stuff. We'll put that on the menu. There we go. Let's see. This guy. Already level three. Go ahead and add a few of those. And then... Great trigger fish. That's a pretty big upgrade there, too, on the happiness. Yeah, yeah. Hit it. That sounds pretty good. Let's open. Open! Ah, she's back. Good. I have your dish for you. I'm working on it right now. Here we go. Right to your... Right to your face hole. Disgusting as usual. The look of it just ruins my appetite. Even so, a promise is a promise. <laughs> uh, 
Oh my god, I love this game. How do you like it? It's good, it's tasty. I can taste the white tip reef shark fat inside the crispy whole roast. But it's not an overly cloying flavor. Is, is this ginger? The ginger scent mixes with the strong flavor of the head. It's quite lovely. Pardon me, I wasn't expecting it to be this good. The Book of Five Rings states that one should look at the essence of something instead of its appearance. Sharks look terrible on the outside, but they have robust meat. And their head has a delicious taste. This whole roasted shark head brings such traits to their maximum potential. I must admit it, this is good. You pass, Boncho. Let me tell you why I'm here then. This restaurant needs to hire people. I can help you with that. What do you mean? Do you still need to go it alone, Boncho? This place is already operating at full capacity. Things might be okay for now, but you won't be able to cope with even when even more customers come. I can't continue working alone, but it's not easy to find people I can trust. I'm Yoshi the Recruiter. This is what I do these days. Let's start by putting out a hiring ad. Yay, help! Hire employees to reduce the workload. Employees help serve food in the dining area or make cooking food faster. Let me tell you how to recruit staff. Pay close attention to what I say. Press control to post a hiring notice. Press the flyer to begin the hiring notice. Resumes can be read starting the next day. Your current resumes will be discarded. Cool. Hiring has begun. Good. The recruitment results become available the following day. I'll tell you more tomorrow. All right then, cool. There's that. Is that enough? Nailed it. Yes. Yes. Ah, uh, that enough, that enough? Nice. Getting better. Oh, apparently we had another shark head. I don't know how that's possible. Let's go ahead and uh, redo our wasabi real quick. Nice. Thank you. When you were playing DD2, was the update for relationships? That was on the experimental sphere. Yeah, you gotta do the experimental branch for that. Oh, yeah! Nailing it now. Better at the green sea. Bronze acquired. Let's go. New recipes added. All right. New unlocks. Kitchen staff. Add interior. Let's go. Yes. yes. Let's clean up. Easy peasy. Yes. Not even having to run, dude. Well, I had to jinx it, didn't I? All right, great day at the restaurant. Thank you. Yes. Big money. Five more artisans flames. Same here, Psycho. This has been fantastic. Big fan of this. Hey, you haven't quit diving yet, have you? No. What is it this time? I'm doing some investigating for an important paper. I'm going to need some help. Give me three blue shells and three brown shells. Okay, okay but aren't you supposed to be doing this sort of thing yourself? Are you kidding me? Writing a paper requires a ton of research and investigation. What you're doing is only a very tiny part of it all. So don't let it get to your head. Hurry along. I don't have much time left until the deadline. Mm -hmm. You really are impossible. Mm. But since you say it's for a paper, was it blue shells and brown shells? Samurai Fuchs! You'll be three years. Welcome back in. Appreciate it. Bear hugs. Already? <laughs> that was harder than I expected. These are hard to find. <laughs> Apparently I had them already. Well, this isn't bad. Now then, if I just complete the delivery to Echo Watcher, or Eco Watcher. Ta da! Haha! <laughs> Research level gained. Eco Watcher? Oh, you don't know? EcoWatcher is a mission-based app made to protect the environment. You get points for completing missions on the app and get rewards for reaching certain levels. So this was for points on the app, not for a paper? Oh, uh, 
Well, you, you can say they're basically the same thing. You try it out too if you're interested. See ya. More apps, yay. Just what we needed, right? Use the Eco Watcher app to check on various ecological missions and gather points to receive various rewards. Cool. Check the phone real quick. Oh, we gotta go like their posts on Cooksta real fast. Very important. Delicious shark meat. We received an award! Yay, Boncho! Look at us ranking up. Need to get 20 more followers for silver. All right. It does look pretty unappetizing. I'll give her that. I can't disagree with that. All right. We'll check our uh, Marinka cards, too. I love this. <laughs> ah, yes. Very good Marinka cards. Ah, nice. You can already, de already uh, deliver some stuff. Nice. 20 more research points. All right. Get an eco health bracelet. If we're able to level this up. Cool. Oh, it doesn't keep playing it? It should keep playing it. Come on now. Let's go ahead and upgrade our diving suit. So we can reach that new uh, node. And then I'm going to upgrade my cargo box, too. Bring even more fish. And then why not? Might as well upgrade the air tank, too. Cool. All right. Let's go on one more dive. The net is OP, by the way. I am excited to hopefully try it again. I'm loving how many different things we've found already. It really just feels like we're scratching the surface, too. Well, you know, in a manner of speaking. Dolphin Buddy again? Oh, no. Did she get caught again? All right, I'll come help. You must be the dolphin from before. Okay. Why does it look like it's in a hurry? Okay. Come to think of it, I don't see the pink dolphin this time. What happened to the dolphins? Let's go find out. The Fall Guys composer. Oh, really? That's interesting. What on earth? Oh, the pink dolphin. Pirates must have captured it illegally. I should cut its net. Get it, Dave. Get it, Dave. Before they yank it up. Oh, oh they're shooting me. What the fuck? Ah! Don't shoot me. Jesus. No. No, 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 no. Naughty pirates. Pulling a murderer man over a single dolphin capture. Y'all need to get away from this place. It is not safe for you. Oh, that's adorable. What's up, buddy? Oh, yeah? He said he loves me. They got only left another gift. I hope neither of them get caught again. Large gold bar. That seems pretty valuable. All right. Let's hit this, uh... Let's hit this waypoint, finally. What we've been trying to go for forever. Oops. Lots more inventory space now. Build up the O2. And, oh, look, it's a whale! Holy shit! Just a straight up whale back there. There we 
go. Refill the ammo. Alright. Little scooter, thank you very much. More seashell. Good stuff. Oh, fuck. Yeah, I could probably take him out. Get another shark head. Oops. Oh, wait. Come on. Oh, fuck! Ah! No! Dave fought off a shark! What a badass! Look at Dave go. Uh-oh. There we go, nice. There's the head, there's the meat. How's that taken care of? Let's not waste all that. I need it later. Grab these things first. Maybe Dolphin stole that gold from the pirates and got stuck in a trap while running away. Believable. Uh, I would like that ammo, actually. I'm leaving you be, buddy. Don't worry. There we go. Wow, so this is the place. Let's see, hmm. Signal's coming from inside. There are letters I've never seen before written on the pillar. Hmm. If we had a tool of some sort, we can move aside that pile of rocks and try going inside. I think it'd be best to talk this over with Cobra. Come on up for now. I don't want to be done yet. What the frick, dude? I thought I heard something. Dude, this place is spooky down here. Yeah, you get away. Leave me alone. Actually, I want to kill you. Shock harpoon tip. 60% chance of paralysis. Damn. This thing is tough, wow. God damn. Come on now. Oh my god, look at this big thing too. Holy shit. Holy shit, dude. Big old sawtooth over there. Man, I really hope I can take this thing out. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to. Holy shit. What is that, like nine bullets it's taken? 10? 150 HP? Holy shit. Giant Trevally meat. Oh my god, that is a lot. Well, time to head out. Cool. Man, this game is fantastic so far. Very impressed. I found a place with a signal from the Sea People Civilization. I can't hold back my academic thirst to check it out! I'm at an important symposium right now. Please talk it over with Cobra first. I'll come by tomorrow. Huh? How to get rid of rock piles? You'll have to use a bomb, of course! <laughs> Is it okay to detonate bombs underwater? Were you talking about a rock pile somewhere deep below? 
I'm sure it'll be fine. Let's put a little trust in the sea's regenerative power. He's trying to gloss over things again. There's an issue. The delivery ships haven't been arriving lately. I need to get a delivery from a bomb expert I know. Apparently the ship's gone off the radar. I think it's sunk. If I could use the drone I ordered, we could retrieve the supplies. Could you go into the sea and retrieve drone materials? Drone materials? How am I supposed to find them in the ocean? It's huge. Delivery boxes are likely to have been carried by the ocean currents. Look for a place with ocean currents. That sounds dangerous. Noted. You got a lot of meat. You got a lot of meat that time. Nice. All right. I think that is going to wrap it up for me to, for today, though. But this has been a fantastic start here in Dave the Diver. I'm liking it a lot. Hope y'all are too. This is very impressive, man. Looking forward to a lot more. This is an early access too. I can't wait to see what the full version of this is gonna look like.